we have to apologize because we didn't get a video out for you this week not a travel one no no it's a bit of bad luck yeah we've had some bad luck we haven't had the car for for a few days this week because it was getting fixed yeah we had a we're actually shopping and the car was in a car park we we're inside the supermarket and some teenagers threw rocks on threw it. rocks at the car yeah. and damaged the back yeah they damaged it so it's had to go off to the body repairers really yep. bad luck yeah probably yeah so we haven't had a car um, or any transport to travel anywhere to film so what we've done is over the last few weeks we have been doing a little bit of filming around our garden here at home <laughs> and it's beautiful because it's spring yep. so I put it together made a little video for you hope you will stay around and, and watch it yes and enjoy it and yep. have a great weekend yep. How's the new angle grinder? Excellent. Show me. Like a knife through butter. Oh, that's like good. Like a knife through butter, sorry. Oh. Are these the cutest little things you've ever seen? We picked up four little day old chicks this week. They're both going to be good, look, good layers when they grow up. And they've got two more, two more little chickens that we have uh, in the brooder box, which I'll show you in a second. So we went to a, a, a poultry farm and we collected them this week and they're one day old. So today they're about four days old. And already they're growing little wings. Very, very cute, aren't they? Isn't there something about baby chickens that just makes, you, makes people happy, don't you think? I always think of toilet paper ads and, and tissue ads when I see baby chicks, they're so cute. Look at Molly, she's not really sure what to make of them. What do you think, Molly? Wanna have a look at your chicks? chickens it's nearly two weeks old isn't it cute they're very, getting very tame now because we take them out and we pat them all the time and this is a rose the first rose from our garden oh chicken and it smells fantastic when you think of spring you think of chickens don't you and flowers and calves and lambs they cute and um the chickens have a little friend Say hello, Molly. You like chicken? Say hello, chicken. Hey, hey, chicken. A hey, chicken. Hello, Molly. I don't know about licking your lips. I don't think that's a really good thing to do. But you can be friends. Hey, you can be friends. <laughs> yeah, all mothers can relate to this. That there's nothing worse than when your babies leave home and it's time for them to leave the nest and go start their new life outside and hang on just one sec. Just, just so that you got a bit of perspective, these are two of my babies. I've actually got four of them, but this, this is two of them. And we've had them since they were baby chicks, since they were one day old. But today's the day that you're gonna go outside and you're gonna leave your little chicken brooder in our laundry and you're gonna go out and discover your new hen house and peck on the ground and scratch away and be chickens. You can see how tame they are, can't you? They really are tame, hey? Okay? And that was the whole reason why we got them as, as day old chicks, so that they would be really tame by the time they're old enough to go outside, which they are now. They're gonna go outside. They probably won't lay eggs now. They're probably about six weeks now. They won't lay eggs probably for another three months or so, but that's okay. They'll have fun outside. Ready girls? Let's go see a new home. Here you go, I want to show you Matthew's vegetable garden because it's going so fantastic. Let's have a look. These are the tomato plants. They're going pretty good. And over here we have butternut pumpkin. There's also carrots in there as well. I forgot to mention those carrots in there. So here's Matthew's beetroots. They're really growing well. 
And the zucchinis are amazing. They're flowering and taking off. Got a few strawberries in this one and a bit of rhubarb and some herbs. Isn't this funny? We've got some visitors from next door. They've, 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 come, out, they've come to check out our babies. This one's beautiful. Have a look at this one. It's like the best looking chicken. So this is a work in progress. Paul's put, Paul and Matthew have put a grate over their planted seeds and the seeds are to grow something called clackatucka for the, for the chooks to eat. And this clackatucka will give the, give the chooks nourishing greens to eat when they're pecking around and that's when we let them outside. Here they are in their new little home. They look pretty happy, don't they? They've got a little welcoming committee from the chickens next door to come say hello. So here's our four babies here. And you can see we've put a sandy bottom underneath. They've got their little house at the back to keep them warm and dry. They've got shade underneath there. Then as they get a bit bigger, we will keep, this door will stay open all during the day. And they're in a big enclosed cage with a soft wire roof in case they fly up so they don't hurt themselves. And then when they get a lot bigger, all this area will have been will have grown out a little bit and they'll have this and they'll have a little day hut during the day and this one um, is quite big so that's good can you see the flowering jacaranda up there it's beautiful isn't it okay here are the chooks inside their little chook house and as you can see they're pretty keen to get out so first time we're going to let them out into their bigger area with the Tucker Tucker. Ready girls? Here we go. There you go. Can't let you come. Hmm. Not sure. Yeah, a bit uncertain, but oh, straight for the grass. They've been ironing that off for a few days. Yeah. <laughs> Very active. And they're loving it. So I hope, hope you enjoyed our little look around the chooks. I love chickens. I just think they're the best things. Very therapeutic. There's nothing better than watching a chicken scratch. Is there? You know, wander around. Look at this. Baby pineapples. Or one. <laughs> this you can't really see I don't think you can really tell by the camera but this is a big mound of leaves and it's been put together from all the leaves around our garden by a bush turkey so the male bush turkey prepares a big nest and then he goes out and finds a female to come here and lay her eggs he's made a really big nest There you go, so I hope you enjoyed uh, having a little look around the garden and seeing our chickens in their first night away from home. But they look pretty happy, didn't they? So I'm sure they'll be fine. And we hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you on our next one. Bye. <laughs>